Welcome! In this review, we will be comparing D750 and D610, two advanced DSLR cameras by Nikon. Nikon D750 was introduced to market in September 2014, and Nikon D610 was launched in October 2013. There is only 11 months difference between D750 and D610, so we are expecting this to be a fair comparison regarding age and technology level. Here is a brief look at the main features of Nikon D750 and Nikon D610 before getting into our more detailed comparison. The D750 have ISO range between 100 to 12,800, while the D610 have ISO range between 100 to 6,400. The D750 have tilting screen, while the D610 have fixed type screen. The D750 shoots 6.5 frames per second, while the D610 shoots only 6. Both of them have the same 24 megapixel, full frame CMOS sensor. Both of them have Nikon F mount for the lenses. Both of them have optical viewfinder. Both of them have weather sealed body. Now we will talk about reasons to choose Nikon D750 over Nikon D610. It has a tilting screen. It has a wireless connection. It has a 100% higher max ISO. It have 12 more focus points. It have 330 more frames with a single charge. It is 10 grams lighter in weight. It has a smartphone remote capabilities. Now we will talk about common strengths of Nikon D750 and Nikon D610. Both of them have built-in flash. Both of them have external flash shoe. Both of them have optical viewfinder. Both of them have raw support. Both of them have face detection focus. Both of them have microphone and headphone ports. Both of them have environmental sealing body. Both of them have time-lapse recording feature. Both of them have top LCD display. Both of them have shutter life expectancy of 150,000 cycles. Both of them have two storage slot. And finally, please note that both of them does not have in-body image stabilization. Now we have reached the end of our video. Hope you found it useful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe in our channel. See you in the next one.